okay uh, right now I have already launched my zap All right. I'm just gonna show this uh, particular tool inside zap itself so I'm running it by itself now if you go into the tools of the zap you will notice that one of the feature that is available is your encode decode and hash now let me just run this first you will prompt up a message like this where you actually can encode decode uh, quite a number of things right uh, the three main is your encode decode as well as hash and of course when you do your encoding there is a quite a number of encoding as well or uh, including your java script encoding html ascii url b64 and the same now why do we actually need to do this is because sometimes you do find uh, encoding inside the uh, source code like for instance okay let's do a let's say if i find a uh, code something like this okay. sorry percentage let's say six something like this so if I find a code like a percentage uh, 24 6 triple zero now actually I'm not basically reading it as a very a percentage number or very large number uh, what you are actually seeing is basically this uh, URL encode version of the price for instance uh, 6000 so this basically uh, once you dump it inside the decode feature you can see oh it's possibly uh, pricing okay and uh, you can also use the encoding feature quite nicely like for instance what if i want to encode something that is for let's say uh, lim uh, code space or okay space one then follow by this all right now uh, of course this is i used this previously in my uh, sql injection all right but uh, what if I can't type it into the text directly? Right? Somehow the text actually block this. Right? So I can actually look into the URL encoding. So I have a URL encoded form of this actual uh, text. And I can actually use this in place of the inside the proxy in place of the actual text that I have on top. So it's actually a very small little feature. Uh, it doesn't have all the uh, encoding or decoding that you probably would want, but it is an offline version. So you don't actually have to be connected to any internet to uh, use this feature. Uh, of course, there are a lot of other encoding, decoding uh, features, uh, applications on the web that you can actually find that are for free, but uh, this is just a particular inbuilt feature inside your Z itself so feel free to use this